Over the last few weeks, I have discovered an experimental vision. A vision interested in creating videos that seem to bridge the worldly and the otherworldly. A vision found in low light type conditions. A vision found utilizing the existing light sources within the frame, but using movement and slow shutter speeds to achieve a certain kind of effect. I have a vision of a physical world and a spiritual world somehow coexisting and being interpreted as a single image. I don't mean it as a single stationary image, not like a, not like a photo, but as a living, breathing representation. I'm hoping to create through in-camera manipulation and through post-editing, something that is a little different to what others might be doing. I'm a little intense in my pursuit of this ghostly vision. I believe that with every attempt, I'm getting myself closer to the fulfillment of that vision. It's something of a mission and I can sense that vision becoming more coherent. I had a vision of a unique insight. But when I first considered it, I had no real idea as to how I would be able to manifest it. I once got a glimpse of it when I was filming for something unrelated, maybe just a few moments of it, but it was enough to hatch an idea that would eventually become a challenge. It was a challenge technically, and it was a challenge artistically, and I wasn't sure who else might be interested in what might be achieved by following this rabbit hole down its forever. I'm not quite there yet, but I am a lot closer to there than I was the last time. I often wonder where in fact my visions for this particular vlog will eventually than I was the last time. I often wonder where in fact my visions for this particular vlog will eventually lead me to. Whether what I find quite interesting and challenging and worthwhile will always be those things. I'm a filmmaker, a vlogger and a YouTuber looking to be unique in a sea of other filmmakers who are just as interested and as dedicated as I hope myself to be. Many people then spy me. At the same time, I'm almost violating my purposeful attempts to not let my inspirations become overly influential in my work. I am a reclusive kind of spirit, and maybe that spirit is what seeks to remain self-contained and self-influential. I see so many people influenced by one or two YouTube creators, and their influence is warranted because they have helped define what vlogging looks and sounds like in 2018. I have no hope in trying to emulate what it is that they have masterfully put together, so maybe that is why I so badly want to find my own way. Don't get me wrong, I have watched 101 tutorial videos on vlogging and filmmaking. I just find that for me, to keep the journey interesting, I have to look for my own vision, however fleeting the glimpse of that vision may be, and have to make vlogs in my own image, whether that's good or bad. 
Thank you.